Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's time uh, for Mr. Stephen to start uh, the week right by having... Uh, well, start, start the week, it's Wednesday, but never mind, let's have another dab, shall we? And as of recording this, it's actually very, very cold where I am right now, so I've put my jacket on, so I'm a bit more, a bit more warmer. Um, and without thinking that I'm going to have lights on, and that's going to make me... Oh, hot over the course of the thing. Never mind. Uh, last week, if you remember, we finished um, with me making a massive mistake and removing the floor from a lot of the building. Well, I've put the floor back because I thought it was important. Um, and I've also added these in. Look, isn't this cool? So you can walk forward to there and go out of there. Here. This is the uh, entity detectors that we were creating at the end of uh, the last one. There's, there's, there's three in place, two doorways with three of those in place. So the other ones are the uh, ones to the exterior. There you go. Can do that. And, and the, the interfaces on these are really simple. So you choose the radius for each one of those and set it to. I've set it to players. You could set it to items or to a custom thing or all entities. A living entity or animals or monsters. Uh, I've set it to players just so that it only opens for players. Um, so that means that if we had a horse behind here or something like that, the horse wouldn't be able to get out, but the player would be able to walk through. That's cool, isn't it? Isn't it? I think it is. Anyway, today we're going to be doing some redstone. Um, we're starting to do some redstone. I can only sleep at night, but it's virtually night time already, look. Sun is going down. I don't really want to start until the sun's gone. Uh, but we, what we can do, I suppose... Um, now, do I have these in? I've got some. Uh, what, do I, what am I going to want? I'm going to want another three of those, plus another one of those. It's four. Let's go with... Uh, let's just say start. Uh, we'll do ten of them, and then they, then we've got a, 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 a enough access to them. Um, we I want some uh, I want some of those as well. And luckily, let's do another. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! That's comparators. I don't need comparators. I need repeaters. Let's do. Let's do twenty repeaters. We'll take the redstone torches that we've got. We don't need any of these, but we're going to go out, grab um, oops, some of those. And we've got a redstone transmitter and a redstone receiver, which is the ones that we made last week. Uh, so we'll start off with that now. Now it's night time. Now I can go to bed. OK, and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making a secret room which um, should be fun. Uh, so there's another couple of things that we're going to need, but we don't need a lot more. First of which, we'll have to go out here to get, because we need a frame. Uh, we need an item frame. One of these things. So we've got that. We only need to, in fact, I'm going to take about three of them. Uh, the reason that we've got three of them is that two of them need to be decorative so that they don't so you don't know which one is is the hidden button that's what we're going to be making uh, and the other one uh, I think we've got buttons here actually no we need we need as well some stone buttons so let's make ten of those as well just so that we've got them not that I think we're going to be needing a lot of them um, we're going to be doing some awesome stuff, and what we need here is we need a place where uh, we can we can start having a staircase. So I think we should have a staircase here that goes. That's the wrong one. Oops. One, two, three, like that. Um, because that's a big enough of a staircase for it to be a, a the right size and everything. Um, okay, we'll take our illumination wand, which we, we're going to need to have with us as well. Uh, just as a as a working concept, we're just going to put a bit of light down here 
uh, A, so we can see what we're doing, and B, so that nothing kills us as we're as we're doing it. Um, and what we're going to want here is to start putting in some pistons because what we want to do okay, uh, is we want one, two, three. Apologise for the phone going off because that's that's what we've got there is a block of three. And on those, we're going to need some more blocks of wood. Uh, so let's go. Thanks. On those, we are going to put one, two, three. And what will happen is that those blocks we've just placed are going to slide across when their staircase is hidden and you won't see them at all. It's very clever, isn't it? And uh, we're also going to use... Um... No, I think that's going to be it, isn't it? Right, okay. That's good. Right, so the other thing we're going to need to do is to put in... Oh, some stairs. And now we need a staircase that goes... Oh yeah, well we need some stairs. <laughs> uh, we haven't got very many of those left. So, open up a crafting grid. We don't need lots. But we'll just get one more one more thing. Yeah. And we're gonna take some stairs. And we're gonna place some Place them down there, like so. Uh, and under here, we're going to place. Uh, let's do this with these blocks so we can go back to it. Let's turn that off, sorry. Uh, we'll with that, that, and that. And then we're going to take out these middle two. We'll put a sticky piston onto. That's the wrong way. I did that wrong. Okay, we'll put a st sticky piston on the top of there, pointing upwards. And we want this to constantly have power. So behind it, we're going to place a block. Like, hello. Like so, there we go. And then we're going to take that. Knock that out. Like that. And we're going to get uh, one of our redstone torches. And we're going to put that on there. So that is constantly up. And you can see what happened now is that we're trapped. No, uh, right. So that's constantly up. Um, what will happen is that when the circuit is gets pressed and released now and all of that stuff, uh, it's going to um, it, it's going to let us fall through the floor. Uh, it, it's going to pull everything down and push everything out, and that's going to be fun. <laughs> that's what we want. That's what we want. Um, okay, back down here. And under these pistons, we'll get some more light out here as well, because that it's we don't want it to get too dark. We don't want the grew around. Uh, we're going to get those there, those there, some here, and some here as well. And then this is where we're going to start using our redstone repeaters. There, there, and there. And this one um, is going to need to be set to three ticks. Um, and what that means is that's just going to give us a bit of time when this is uh, is released so that we can actually uh, access everything. Hello. I don't know what that sound was, but I think it might have been the Gru and that scares the hit out of me. <laughs> we don't we don't want the Gru around here. Thanks. In fact, I'm going to light up a lot of this area so that we don't get him. Because uh, we're going to be working all around here right now. Um, you can see where we are. Look, you can see this is the... Um, under, under here is the uh, floor for outside. For the... Um, oop. <laughs> uh, for the outside, yeah. So, uh, yeah, we want we want to... So I, that's thrown me a lot. I don't know why. Um, right, okay. So we're going to take some redstone. We're going to stick some redstone down there because that's going to be needed. Uh, and then we're going to have, have a look at our uh, button, which we need to have in place. Um, this is going to be more difficult uh, because the button... Actually, the button could be on a different wall. 
but uh, I don't want it to be too far away. Um, we may have to remove this fish thing. So we can place it somewhere like this, maybe? Which could be difficult. In fact, that would be difficult. Um, so we're going to have to find a decent place for the button, but until then, keep going with this, I think. Okay, so, uh, we've got our uh, blocks there. Um, if we were to set those off right now, those would push this, this over. Um, what we now need is to have a, a T flip-flop, which is going to be made with um, some more sticky pistons, basically. Um, and so the way that we're going to do this is we're going to take two... Uh, we'll do it over here a bit. In fact, that means we're going to need to light this area up a bit as well, because... We don't want the groove. Um, let's do it here so it's not too far away. That right, that's where it needs to be. Oh, I know what that sound is. I'm standing too close to the doors. Oh, thank the Lord for that. I thought it was the groove. <laughs> no, that's the wrong way around. That doesn't need to be. There we go. That's better. That's what I wanted. Okay, so that's going to be the... Is that right? Yes. We'll find out in a second. See, I've, I'm I'm thrown now because I'm I'm so worried about the groove thing, but uh, there you go. That's why I should be worried because he's around. He's around if you're not careful, and I'm notoriously bad at being careful. Take a block of redstone, and we're going to put that. Uh, this is called a T flip flop. If I haven't said that before, um, and we're going to stick that there and that there, and we're going to get some. Uh, this is the simplest version of it that I'm I'm aware of. I'm sure there are much simpler versions of it, but there you go. So what happens is you power one of these two blocks and it makes the thing go from one side to the other side and it means you can use this as the basis uh, for everything being open. So first of all, we're going to take the idea of everything being open, which means we need to have no power going to that. And we're going to take a block there and a block there, like that, uh, and these blocks are going to be, um, here we go, uh, those blocks are going to be going off to, well, to there, basically, um, so what we need to do is we need to power this, or rather not power it, um, bring this over here, and we'll have redstone going into there. We'll have redstone going into there as well. How is that going to be different? Well, okay, but what we'll do is we'll take a repeater as well. So we want... Uh, uh, how does this work? Um, this is when, when redstone contraptions get difficult, become difficult. <laughs> Okay, so that when that happens, that's going to retract that. Very important. And we're going to take... i tell you what, we'll, we'll take a few more of these things as well. So we can do this. Set to four. We might, we might change the... In fact, we will change these settings as we're going along. So that this goes down very quickly. So that it, as the blocks push, they don't push it out of the way. But when it comes back, it's better. <laughs> That's the idea, anyway. Um, so when those, when that one's down, we also need to power these blocks here. So we could take um, a redstone signal here, 
what will be a redstone signal here. Actually, thinking about that, that's probably the wrong way to go. We'll do that. We'll do that, that, and that. And that's going to push these across. And you see now, that's pushed those across there, like so. So, let's grab one of these buttons that we've got here. And we're going to use this to just test out the T flip flop. Okay. And that seems to have done everything right. Pulled everything down. Okay. And you see what's happening is that this, this redstone block is moving backwards and forwards. Let's do that again. Yes, look at that. So what we need to do here is make sure we get one of these blocks powered and um, or uh, as a button. And then we've, we've, we've essentially, this thing is making a, a switch out of a button. But it means that we can use uh, buttons instead of switches in order to do stuff. That's it for today. That's the big thing for today. Tomorrow... We'll be back here, back in exactly the same place, um, and we want to actually put some more stairs in so that we don't have the situation where uh, as soon as something is, uh, it, you know, so you've only got one staircase. We want our staircase to appear because we want it to, to look like it's a proper thing and a proper stairway. Um, so that'll be tomorrow. Anyway, if you've enjoyed what you've seen tonight, and I know it's been a bit... But I feel that these are a bit more interesting, so I hope you too as well. If you've enjoyed what you've seen tonight, then please, please do uh, give us a big thumbs up, because those are important. And uh, also, if you're new here, or if you haven't done already, please hit the subscribe button. Please hit the little bell next to the subscribe button. And uh, that means that every time uh, that we put out a video, you will be notified about it. Uh, and until next time, thanks very much for coming along, and I will see you then. <laughs> Don't forget, keep crafting. <laughs>